going on here? After all, these three did escape from the DUP's own detention facility at Curtin K. They turned the log house into a hospital? Have I been out? Nick, man, what the hell happened? This is a military mess. The DUP has just been brought in to clean it up. Mr. Stanley, thank you for your time. Oh my god. How could anyone do this? How many people did she hurt? And no one could stop her? Betty. I'm glad to see you're up. Yeah. I guess Augustine was in bluffing, huh? Well, no one here was going to turn you in to protect themselves. We're comish. We take care of our own. I guess I did the right thing. You imagine what that bitch would have done to me if I'd actually talked? Probably the same thing she did to everyone else in this room when you didn't. Do me a favor and um, tell everybody else that uh, I said uh, thanks for taking one for the team. Yeah. Oh, man, Delson. Whoa. <laughs> Damn it. I thought we were going to lose you there. A little concrete in the legs. Something more than that. Oh, glad to see fast healing seems to be a part of your new uh, thing. Uh, speaking of which, uh, the craziness with the hands, is that gone? Yeah, I don't know, man. There's no smoking in the longhouse, remember? Right. And I wouldn't want to get in the way of anyone's recovery. Recovery? Hey, Delson, these, these people aren't getting any better. They're dying, man. You don't know that. No, but the doctors who came through here when you were out, they do. And they said that... They said the only way those shards are coming out is the exact same way they went in. What? Yeah. But that, that was Augustine and her concrete power. Yeah. Then screw it, man. Looks like you and me are going to Seattle and we're gonna go get her. Whoa, 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 wait, what? You think you're just gonna charm her into coming back here with you? Come on, man, I know you took a bump to the head, but you two didn't exactly hit it off last time you were together. Reggie... I did this. And I gotta fix it. No, damn it, Dustin, you just got back on your feet. Look, I know you want to help, but the doctors have already said the only... The only way it's getting out is with the same power, I get it. Which means... We don't actually need Augustine. We just need her power. <laughs> okay, now you've lost me. I'm a goddamn power sponge, remember? If I got smoke, why can't I get concrete? <laughs> yeah, but what, what if smoke was just a fluke, huh? I mean, think about it, you'd have to go through, a, what, a thousand DUP guys just to get to her? Yeah, probably something like that. I'll explain in the truck. What truck? I don't have a truck, I... That's my truck. All right, I got this whole thing figured out, okay? We, we hit the town, we load up at the all-you-can-leech conduit power buffet, we maybe swing by the Space Needle, always wanted to see it, and then we're back home to save some lives. You do realize when we hit the town, there's a fair chance the town's gonna, you know, 
hit back. What does that even mean? It means that Seattle has half a million people that aren't exactly thrilled about the bioterrorists that are already there. You think they're gonna welcome you? Wake up, man. Look, don't worry, Dell, all right? We're gonna fix this thing. I'm gonna find you a cure. A cure? But shooting smoke out of your fingertips isn't exactly normal, man. Just because it's not normal doesn't mean that it needs a cure, okay? Van Gogh wasn't normal. Gandhi wasn't normal. Yeah, but people weren't scared of Gandhi, all right? People are afraid of bioterrorists. They're freaks. See, that's pre-programmed bull... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit. Great. Huh. Well... Looks like we're walking the rest of the way. <laughs> Walk? What? Yeah. Where are you going? Hey! Crap, would you look at this? Uh, look, you know, if you're having second thoughts, I completely... Are you kidding me? This is amazing! This is destruction. This is self-defense, man. The roadblock was set up to attack them. Yeah, because they're bioterrorists. Well, it didn't stop them, and it's not gonna stop this bad boy either. Man, this is like a po... Oh, this must be the mothership. Jesus, Delson! Hey, are you okay? Okay? I'm better than okay, man. I think I picked up a new trick. Yep, new. <laughs> oh, God. yeah. Definitely new and improved. Delson, this is not improved, man. We're trying to fix the problems you already have, not add new ones. What do you think? Augustine is just sitting on her ass? I gotta power up if I'm gonna go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Concrete Queen. Hey, I'm hoping to avoid that. Listen, there might be another way that we can get to Augustine. What other way? I, what other I way? I have a few connections in Seattle, right? Some in the police force. No, if no, we no, get no, no, no. This is not the point where Reggie swoops in and makes everything all right. What? This is not your problem to fix. It is mine. Oh, is somebody there? Can you hear me? There. Perfect. You want to go help somebody? Go save damsel in distress. Anyone? It's not... All right, fine. We both go. Come oh, on. no, 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 no. You I go need... play super cop, okay? I will catch up with you in a minute. All right, but don't go anywhere. And for God's sake, don't touch anything! I'm gonna touch everything. Hello. You're up first, little guy. Okay, yeah, that could definitely be habit forming. Yeah, good to go. The trick. Man, once we hit this city, I'm gonna have to keep an eye out for those things. not believe what that beeping was. Let's get up here, okay? I found a bus full of relief workers that's stuck. I'm trying to convince them to just abandon the bus. I don't want to leave all the medical supplies. Well, just tell them to hold on. I'll get the bus unstuck. Nelson, I know what you're thinking, and don't. Dude, I just took out a fleet of quadcopters. I think I can dig out a bus. Trying to convince them to just abandon the bus. They don't want to leave all the medical supplies on top. Well, just tell them to hold on. I'll get the bus unstuck. Nelson, I know what you're thinking, and don't. Dude, I just took out a fleet of quadcopters. I think I can dig out a bus. 
This is gonna take forever. There's gotta be a faster way. I am unstoppable! Delson, I told you not to- yep, Sorry, Reg. Can't hear you over the sound of my heroics. Nelson, I'm not- Ah, uh, lost you. Have to hit the mute button. Okay, looks like the rest of the way is clear. I'm gonna ride this baby straight into Seattle. We got a problem. Some of the people on the bus, they saw you doing your super thingy to clear the way. And? And they're afraid of you. What? Look, I told you, man. Bioterrorists aren't especially popular. So what, am I like Rosa Parks and they want me to sit on the back of the bus? No, they want you to sit outside the bus. Look, they don't want you in here, right? They said if you come on, they're gonna get off. Then let them walk! I don't care! You think I can't take this door down? You are not gonna do that. These people have never seen anything like you before, and they're scared. Right? And I can't blame them. He says he's gonna break down the door. Go! Sir! Just give me a second! Look, just let me run them across the bridge. I'll come right back for you, alright? It'll take five minutes. Come on, man. I can't let you on the bus. Five minutes. Switch on the GPS track. 